Okay, guys, I'm back. I got the trash mission sitting in my lap. It's sitting in my legs. So I wanted to make sure that you see this piece here. That this is the bearing housing that the bearings came. This piece and this piece over here are the two pieces that broke when I was mowing because they had worn out because they weren't replaced. And I have them sitting up here like this. And I put the belt on right there. Put the belt on here. I left this original piece that came with it there because it was kind of hard to pry loose. But I pried it up enough to get that new piece, that new metal piece that you see that slides back and forth, that actuator. This whole section is called an actuator kit or whatever it's called. And once you actually put pressure, once you mush, push your gas pedal, your gas pedal will will push on here and it's going to pull this pulley upward when it pulls the pulley this pulley upward when it pulls that pulley upward then the pulley goes between this it's a slit see that slit it's a slit on on the left and the right on both sides there's a little slit that these slide through slide right straight through and what they're supposed to do is when you put pressure on it it's supposed to make sure that these two pieces stay on that bar on that rod it's supposed to make sure the more pressure you have on it it slides and get real tight and stays it has a free movement it can slide back and forth so that it can um you can put pressure on it and it will keep this piece attached to the bar and then once you release it of course, there's no pressure on it, and it slides back and forth. All right? So now what I'm going to do, and I only put a couple screws in here, just a screw here and a screw there, so I can check it and see the motion of it and how it was functioning and working. So hopefully, hopefully, this is now the, this will, this will fix the problem with that free-floating, um, that free-floating uh, pedal, gas pedal. So I'm going to go ahead on and finish putting the rest of this together. These, that piece, I didn't even use yet. That, I didn't use it. So, not yet. I'm hoping I don't have to use it. And if I do, of course, I'll just make another video and come back and tell you about it. But right now, I'm going to finish putting um, the screws in it. And I'm going to finish installing the transmission. All right? Everything else up here, the springs... And all the rest of that looks good. And um, the, the fact that it's getting old, I would suggest if you're going to use these bad boys, take your time mowing. Make sure, I, I even went on my mower deck today. Uh, I had to replace one of the pulleys. So I put a new pulley on the mower deck, even when I sharpened my blades. And the belt, you know I put a new belt on that. So my blades are sharpened, the new pulleys installed, the pulleys are greased. This is a, a a new dry pulley here, and this piece I replaced a year ago. So so far, this piece looks good and it's holding up. And um, of course, you guys know when you put it in gear, you 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 put your brake on. This piece right here is a shifter to put it in first and reverse. This piece, that piece puts it in reverse, and um and put put it in um drive. It puts it in drive and reverse, forward and backwards, forward and backwards. This is your brake right here. This is your brake. And uh, you know you push your brake. And uh, let's see if I can put it in one of those gears. Hold on a second. Uh, let me see if I can just maybe try it. Push it back one. Okay. Okay, there you go. And then this one would, this would go forward. See that? See how that moves forward? that would move forward and once you decide what gear you're going in and this is in like i'm assuming that's probably i think that's drive and i think this one is reversed i'm not so sure this gear right there that you see is probably drive i think and then that gear right there is reversed because once i pulled it or or it could be reversed i don't know because i had the, the transmission sitting in my lap but anyway once you get this piece lined up with that spot, then you mash with the gas pedal and it actually puts pressure on this belt. 
it pulls this pulley up once you put pressure on it. See how that pulley moves? You guys can't really see. See how it moves up and down like that? All right. And then once you put pressure on it, it squeezes that belt. And that's how you get that motion to move forward. Because right now it's idling. This is constantly spinning like that. Constantly spinning just like that. And then when you put pressure on it and match the gas pedal, this piece comes up and squeezes that belt. And then you get your forward motion or your backward motion. All right. And let me go ahead and put the other screws in it. This is... I don't hear no rubbing. I don't hear nothing. I believe it's set in the right spot it's supposed to go. So let's see how well this does. Alrighty. And uh, my suggestion is don't 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 mow too fast. Cause this this right here, these just just take your time and mow. Make sure your blades are sharp, and um, and just get it done. Alrighty. All right, guys. I'll be back shortly. As always, thank you for watching, and please subscribe.